Hi, Comic Book fans. Welcome to another SuddenlyComics.com video. Uh, today, I'm just going to show you some weird and wonderful DC comic pickups uh, that I uh, picked up from an auction uh, a couple of weeks ago. Um, these are really um, some very <laughs> strange comics. <laughs> right. First up, we have got a showcase. Uh, showcase number 74. Now, showcase... Uh, was a great series uh, and introduced a whole range of characters into DC. Uh, so a good one to pick up. And this indeed is the first appearance of this character here called Anthro, who is a sort of caveman guy. Um, and he, this is drawn and written by the same person called Howie Post, who was uh, a sort of a veteran of the newspaper strips. Um, and this is his creation and throw now i uh, also picked up not just the showcase one but also uh most of the entire run of anthro so this is uh anthro then got his own series uh which was planned to be um ongoing uh so here we have anthro number one battle of the sexes yes we're in 1968 here so indeed the battle of the sexes had just begun <laughs> <laughs> and uh, anthro number two apes or men uh another nice looking cover here by howie post uh number three uh now recently alan and i just discussed this because it appeared on um sold at heritage a copy of this sold at heritage for 300 odd dollars uh admittedly it was in a higher grade than this one but this is not bad it's getting a pretty decent grade uh, and throw number three. Uh, also have and throw number four. Um, and lastly, I have and throw number five. There were, in fact, six of these. So, being the completest that I am, I am going to have to search out and throw number six. <laughs> so, there we go. Uh, next up, from the same sort of period of time, we've got the checkerboard. Uh, uh, trade dress on this um so we're in the 1960s this is the sort of period of time where the batman tv show was on and everything was hip and groovy <laughs> so this is joe orlando uh drawing a character called scooter uh that lover doll <laughs> on his bike uh that's really 60s isn't it look at this um Zipsville, he doesn't turn me on. <laughs> um, I think I've got two copies of that. I think I've already got a copy of that somewhere. So I've now got two copies of Scooter number one. Uh, here we go. This is uh, an 80-page giant, more secret origins. Right, another showcase one. Um this is showcase number 77. Again, this is a first appearance. Showcase is very good for first appearances. This is the first appearance of a, a detective team called Angel and the Ape. Um, yeah, and <laughs> O'Day and Simeon, private investigators. Um, yes, indeed. So there we go. Showcase, um, that's the first appearance of Angel and Ape. And I have also got... Angel and Ape number one, case of the missing go-go girls. <laughs> Again, you can see we're firmly in the swinging 60s here. <laughs> Goodness me. And a bit of social commentary, I think. Uh, next up, we have got another showcase, first appearance. This is of a character called Batlash. Will he save the West or ruin it? Um, I think this guy is meant to be a sort of, um, you know, a sort of cowboy uh, Lothario. You know, he's a bit of a woman's <laughs> a woman's man. Um, yeah. So Batlash, first appearance of Batlash in Showcase 76. And to go with that, I have got Batlash, number one. <laughs> So uh, some nice, quite nice pickups from this uh, from this auction. All a bit obscure uh, and off the main track. 
And then finally, again, we're definitely in hippie land here. This is issue one of Brother Power the Geek. And it says, here is the real life scene of the dangers of hippie land. Just look at that cover. Amazing. Um, these, these, those, those ones really are pieces of social commentary from the time in which they were produced. Right, next up, I've got some DC specials. Um, I already have a couple of these, um, but this was a lot. And, um, you know, so I, I got this one, for instance, which is the first appearance of um, Abel. Uh, yeah, this is the first appearance of Abel, Kane's brother. And in this issue, DC special number four, uh, Kane uh, introduces Abel to the three witches. Um, who run the witching hour and uh Kane of course runs a house of mystery and he introduces him and says Abel is going to be moving into the house of secrets uh so that is the first appearance of Abel and I think his first appearance in house of secrets is something like house of secrets 93 something like that uh, next up, we have got uh, a DC special number five, and this is a Joe Kubert special. And there you can see Joe is drawing board surrounded by a number of his creations. Can you name them all? Next up, we've got DC special number eight. I haven't got this one. Wanted the world's most dangerous villains. Nice. Uh, number nine, haven't got this one. I've got a pretty good selection of DC specials now. Uh, this is the strangest sports stories ever told. And this one is, I haven't got, and this is probably the most valuable one of the lot. Uh, this is DC special. It's, number four is worth quite a lot, but I wasn't in great condition. This is number 11. This is actually worth uh, more because it's in a good, better condition. And this is a Bernie Wrightson uh, cover here. Um, and it's a horror mag. So, yeah, that is great. I haven't got that one. Well, I've got it now, but I didn't have it before. Uh, number 13, I think I've got this. Strangest sports stories ever told. And finally, DC special number 27, Danger Dinosaur Dinosaurs at Large. There you go, comic book fans. Uh, just some interesting, weird and wonderful DC comics from uh, a recent auction win. Uh, hope you've enjoyed that. That's your lot. See ya again.